Filippo, commiserations on a tough result. What was your assessment of the performance tonight? Um, we prepared the game to be aggressive in certain situations and to defend as a block in the middle third in other situation, which we did quite well in the first half. And we were able to consolidate few possession like we were thinking. We, we know the, the, the quality of the opponent. So uh, you have to play a perfect game and a disciplined game. But then at, at the beginning of the second half, our energy went a little bit down. Our block, defensive block went a little bit down and they were they were actually good on the ball, and we suffered, and, uh, and we suffered a little bit too much. We couldn't consolidate ball when we were regaining. It was complicated. Um, complicated game against a really good and strong team. Um, let's learn something from, the, from this game and try to do better next. You said your players would play with no fear tonight. That was certainly evident. Are there a lot of positives to take from this performance? Yes, let's say that, uh, yes, we were not nervous. We could do something better in possession, uh, of course. But I have to give, give credit to the quality of the opponent also. I mean, you can't think that you go to play in Europe and you dominate the game entirely. So it was... Uh, it was a complicated game, like I said, but uh, maybe if we had a little bit more energy, let's say that, we arrived a little bit tired to this game after three games, couldn't prepare at the best, I have to be honest, but it is what it is. This is our situation right now and we're going to, like I said, we're going to learn from this game and try to do better next. You mentioned the energy there. You made a lot of substitutions in the second half in a short space of time. Is that what you felt needed to change? Fresh legs? Yes, because we were defending as a block. We couldn't uh, low in the field in the defensive middle third. So this was a little bit too much to cover the field for certain players that they play 90 minutes three days ago. Uh, but listen, the squad, the squad is, you know, a, a, any players we have is able to compete at this level which I think we show it, um, it's just, I mean, we could do something better. Uh, I could do something better with the substitution, maybe I had to do something earlier. Uh, sometimes, you know, you read the game in a way and then the game is going to another. It was also for me a really tough night because I couldn't coach, I had to stay behind. I couldn't say much, I couldn't support the team really well. I really suffered tonight, but I think for Euro for me is going to be like that. Not a lot of time to dwell on tonight's results, so the games are coming thick and fast. Next week a trip to the Emirates to play Arsenal, how much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, no, now I'm looking forward to recover and play in water for Sunday. This is a, that's the problem. And then, and then we're going to think about Arsenal. Uh, but, uh, yeah. I mean, one step at a time. Uh, now, now Waterford. Then let's see what to do with the, the trip in London. Is this a worry for you? The volume of games that you have. It is. It is because it's complicated to prepare games, um, and also you have to really pay attention with the with the health of the players. You don't want to have injuries. You don't want to injure them. You have to be you have to be really careful and manage them. Um, uh, they are they are young, but when they play a lot of games, then is a problem. Thanks, Felipe. No problem.